Lightning chain. Check. Rear thrusters. Check. Picnic basket. Uh, check. Right, let's take them. Hello, anyone who may be watching now or later, hit in here along with... Drakir! And welcome back to Orcs Must Die 3 Co-op. I yeah, probably should have put that in the title of the first episode as well, but... Yeah, yeah, that's the last week. So, yeah. Okay, last time we started on this game. And... Okay, seems the sound is still a bit low with this one. Um... We'll see in we'll see in level if it remains low. Oh yeah, last time we started this, uh, and we found out that um, I think was this Mac, Mac. I think it's yeah the Ma Max, the current leader of the order. Maximilian is his full name, I believe. Uh, he has gone missing, and yeah, the enchant, no, the sorceress. I almost called her enchantress after the Marvel uh, character. Uh, the sorceress is looking into where the hell he has gone, and last time that involved looking up in looking into the history of the order. For quite a while ago, a few centuries, I think. Uh, yeah, we got to level seven. Or we finished level six, so now we're at level seven. I'm still, I still kept a note of how much, how many skulls I should have access to, since yeah, this is a bit much, and if, because I've been playing this game with another friend as well. You can see them here. But uh, yeah, uh, we can start when you're ready. Oh right, I was not that. Uh, let's see what. Ice Amulet. Long range multi shot ice attack with secondary short range AoE freeze ability. Sorceress, I've read all about Master Cygnus, but I don't remember Warwick. Warwick was the equal of Master Cygnus and just as heroic in defense of the Order, but all record of his accomplishments was wiped from history. And you're going to tell us why? I will, but first you must deal with these orcs. Uh, hello? Are we not going to talk about how this Warwick guy is clearly in love with the orcs? Wait, what? Okay, I missed that. When I played it with that friend, I tried to dodge as much of the story as possible. But, yeah, the... Why... Why did they erase him from history, then, <laughs> if not he started screwing around with the orcs or something? Yeah, and... Hmm. Wait, is... Th Hmm. Emilia, do you see this green stuff here, right? Yeah, don't... you don't want to fall into it. I'll just keep it at that. I know, but the question is, can we make them fall into it? Possibly, but if we put horse traps on the walls, there's a good chance they might as well get shoved over to the other side instead. And, yeah, as was visible in the preview of this level, we'll be getting another new enemy here. Yeah, wow, um, someone does it into a hot rock. Let's see. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to up the volume for the game because for some reason it is really quiet. Yeah, it's better you raise your volume and I'll be fine as long as I have subtitles on my end. That way I can keep along with the story without having echoes on your end. Let's see. Or without giving you echoes. Is it Oh, wait, that is Google Works. Uh, da, da, da. How high is the sound in here? What, 100%? Okay, that's just plain ass weird. Why is it so silent here? Did I, did I perhaps screw around with the volume mixer on this? No, it's set at maximum as everything else. Why the hell is everything so quiet in this game then? Weird. Hmm. Okay, then again there shouldn't there shouldn't be any music running just now in the preview in the prep phase. But okay. 
Uh, what had we agreed upon again with things? You put down the traps, I put down the obstacles. Yeah, yeah, you're the barricade master, basically. I, I put up two ice traps over here, since, well, is it a final path they need to take before reaching this? Basically, our only show point. Yeah, they're only going to come through one side, though, at the moment. <coughs> yep, and I try to understand the map, but it seems like the... Can't wait. Let's do it! Yeah, no, we're going they... to have to fight them split. We yeah, can't just rely split. on them getting stuck in here. Yeah. Still, still you're going to leave this ice trap here, since, well, it even slow them down. Yeah. We could probably set down some archers here. Actually, we don't have access to archers yet, so we can't. But this would, in replays, this would be a good spot for archers. Oh. And the same would go yeah. for here. Apparently, I have two extra slots to use. Yeah. Uh. Mm. I'm ready, by the way. I guess I can use this. Oh, how do I have that on? Uh. I. Ah, I'm. I'm gonna leave it like that for now. Okay. okay, yeah, I'm ready. Okay, here we go. Bo should be able to do nicely. There we go. Enemies are preparing to breach one of our gates. They've broken through a gate. Oh, heavy. Heavy orcs. Uh, here they come. There. Heavy orcs take less damage from the normal weapons. So that is something that we need to be, uh, keep in mind. They, they take more damage from mystical weapons like the ice amulet or the uh, shock staff. Could you said that? <laughs> oh, big boy. <laughs> okay, I think, I think we got them both at the same time there. Okay, yeah, we're going to need more damaging traps, of course. Can you seriously walk on the trap, you stupid archer? Oh dear. Okay, now it's only from this one. Yeah, so we can extend them a bit here. Mm. Yeah, okay, at least means we can put down more traps. Probably better here for the moment, since we can easily move across. Okay. Probably should have put... Can I... No, I can't. Of course, I can't adjust my <laughs> my tool belt at the moment. Or I would have put the ice emblet up further. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm ready. All right. We get some more money. I have to later inspect if I can make these tour trucks cheaper. I think they only have upgrades for the enemy army uh, slowing more. Front. Watch nope. uh, okay. I want to say, ain't it better to be on this side to fight them? Board, I think. What? Correct. You're talking over the characters. Uh, yeah, it's the it's the Rock Lords and Earth Elementals. We've covered these in Orcs Must Die 2. They're basically Marus... Marus? Yeah. They're basically Russian nesting dolls. You kill one, it turns into two smaller ones. Well, in three stages, Rock Lord, Earth Elemental, and then Rockling. Oh, 
Oop, over. They're almost there. That goes in the pit. I think it's a walk on the spike path. No, 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 Pretty sure you could have put that somewhat better where more would have crossed over it. Yeah, I definitely could put that somewhere better. But someone somehow actually walked on it. Okay, I already lost almost half of our points. Yeah. Moving you. Hurry, because this one is timed. Oh. More enemies on the way. Okay, I'm guessing it, this is the level where they really uh, force you to <laughs> force you to upgrade your stuff. And I I think those tar traps would do a lot better in the pair in the park. In the past, right, with the you're over there. Yeah, I forgot that. Oh, I am good at this. Yeah, I, I will move them over there next uh, turn if I get the chance. Ow. Yeah, just the whole thing with it is to, <laughs> is to guide them into a single line that's a little bit easier to kill. Oh, big boy. Actually, I, I, sh I should stop clicking and just hold the button down. That... Oh, you can do that? Yeah, I forgot that. I did too. Yeah, it has been a week since we did this last. in our rift room we only have half our rift points remaining Another win. okay yeah this is not looking good actually through all of that we need to focus them down in these places yeah though this one is included the main one they're coming from Should look again if yeah i should oh. yeah you fell in i jumped over then i hit something like an invisible wall and just dropped down what no. the heck was that bullshit ray i should use the ice amulet more because that stuns them into place yeah now's the time just okay i was I'm just going to ask only those three carpets. And probably should get rid of these here as well. Okay, just to help this out, just going to move some of these over. Now that's an orc stop. For some reason, my throat is really dry today. <clears throat> Actually, put that one there. That, there. that could be be good to have extra trap there. Maybe we could put up uh, something of a maze over here. Hmm. But we do, we'd need a lot of coin to be able to get enough barricades for that. Hmm. Yeah, ready when you are. Should be good. 
<laughs> right, I'm gonna save some money for now. More enemies on okay. the way! Right, cobalts. Earth Elemental, so I'm focusing fire on that. Yeah, we really need some stronger damage and stuff. Just fire into the crowd. Oh, hello, bye. Deals more damage, but it has that time that it needs to reload. All right, let's grab the free money I saw over there. We will need yeah. it. Hmm. Now they come from both sides, so yeah, now we need to prepare both sides. Of course. Yay. Okay, maybe uh, right. it is yeah. possible to lead them around here for a while, but. I'd... There'll probably be too many of them all in the same place to really make it too you control. Hmm. Yeah, we'll need more on this side. You have to remove the, lo the last half of the past. So you might want to remove your traps there. You're going to ignore three of them. Wait, which three are we talking about? This one, of, of course. I, I, I removed two of the barricades, so of course they're not going to go after over oh. some of your traps. Okay, I see what you mean there. There. Yeah, looking good. Okay. Yeah, this is going to get risky. Come on, bring it. Oops. Something here? Oh, it's a mana potion. Well, I'll save that one for after I shoot into the crowd a bunch. There we go. Oh yeah, we still have that ice spell thing. I think it will is actually kind of helpful here. Yeah. Uh, with the more damaging traps it would be. I, I, I'm pretty sure these ice traps don't deal damage at all. They only stun them. I, they do, I double check. They actually upgrade their damage deal, dealing. Okay. All right. Yeah. I'm just gonna use Nessie. Okay then. All right. Let's see here. I'll keep an eye on the left track. You can keep on the right. Hmm. I remember something about the ice amulet being very useful in the previous games. I need and to regenerate mana. Okay, it takes up a lot more <laughs> mana this time. Probably good yeah, since it's it free. <laughs> it not only has the shotgun effect, it also freezes innately. Okay, so don't come up all at once, it seems, luckily enough. So I can help you out. Trying to... Yeah. Yeah, come on. Alright, now they come from my side. So you're... I hope you can kill the ogre without me. Yeah, done. Um... 
Did I just get a full kill or something there? Nope, now they're coming from both. Archer is trying to shoot over it. No yeah, I've got three ogres here. Okay, you've done with your side. Hmm. With the big boys, we should probably freeze them up. And then... You mean like I just did for you? Yeah, and then we can get a bunch of headshots in on them. Right side. Yeah. Okay. Apparently the blunderbuss shots do get blocked by the shield, but the arrows didn't. Probably better if I did that from add it to its front. Now it's back. Okay, now they're coming from both. Okay, now there's a bunch coming. Okay, one got stripped. Gun. Okay. We're having some trouble, but we are dealing with it now. I'll put these here. Help you a bit since most of the traps are on my side. More enemies on the way. Um Okay, right side. Elementals are the most annoying ones at the moment. It's the freaking nesting doll thing. It seems, uh, seems shotgun the best for them almost. And the triple shot with the with the bow is also doing quite well on them. Uh, can I? Yeah. Okay, back to my side. Earthlings, not uh, rock galings. They're attacking the barricade. They've destroyed the barricade. Did, did an ogre take a swing at you? No. Nope. Okay, then how did the barricade get destroyed? In our rip room. Oh, big boy. Oh. 
We might not. Yeah. Okay, All Rock right. Lords are five points. Ugh. Okay, we're not dropping the. Right. Let's see. I should still have access to six. Uh, pen. Okay. Now I should have access to four. Let's see. Reduce collateral damage taken. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, maybe we should try and for, uh, focus on the on the uh, choke point. Hmm. And this, actually, no, we won't get to talk until the the rock lords show up. Sorceress, I've read all about Master Cygnus, but I don't remember Warwick. Warwick was the equal of Master Cygnus and just as heroic in defense of the Order. But all record of his accomplishments was wiped from history. And you're going to tell us why? I will. But first, you must deal with these orcs. Uh, hello? Are we not going to talk about oh, yeah, we can... Warwick guys? Yeah, you know what? Do that. Block one of the stairs. Yeah. There, there's a good chance that we might get overwhelmed defending the other side, but still. This thing, this thing here is enough to make a hindrance to shoot anything that goes on one or the other side. So, forcing them to go on one side is more preferred. Yeah. Okay. Remove those. Might as well put these here for the moment. Yeah. And I'm ready. That's the stuff. Okay, but yeah, we need. You can see where they're going to go, so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait. Okay, that's that's the really useful. Okay. Yeah, I definitely need to up upgrade the barricades to be as cheap as they can be. If, if we fill this again, I'll tap into the extra skulls that I have to make them cheaper. Might as well be a good idea. For now, I put some temporary traps for the first wave. Yeah. So. I don't think we ever had it with either of the other games that we lost a level, except for the endless one. No, we, we lost the... I think we lost one at least. One or two. Broken through a gate. And some we were extremely close to lower the song. Okay. I think the main... The main downside of the bow is that it doesn't deal too much damage, or it's, it's most useful when you get headshots with it. Because then it deals a lot more damage. Okay, so maybe I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll try using the blunderbuss more this time. <laughs> and it just ran into a face full of buckshot. Yeah, that... Bow for long, blunderbuss short, where probably should have been a lot more obvious from the start. Okay, the stupid ogres are going to get a hidden on me every time at the release, it seems. There we go. A lot better. And now they come only on this side. Now I should be able to block one of these. There we go. And now we need to start on pathway. I need more coin. We need to get them. We need to keep them as busy as long as possible. And it'll probably be best if the entrance is here. So Just put that like there. Train. Force them to go through here. Actually, like a, we could force them to go into this path a bit. Okay, I've got a bit of a map in mind. Yeah, I mean, they temporarily set up over here for now. As always. 
Hopefully it should kill a few. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Ready when you are? Yeah. Uh, oh, wait, wait. The brace on sip. Don't aim at me! Okay, now we should get to talk about the Rock Lords again. Our enemies are breaking through elsewhere! Uh, okay. What is that? Whoa, I have read about these. Earth Lord, I think? Correct. And when you kill him, he will break apart into smaller, faster units again and again. Yeah. Like I said, Maru's got all enemies. Mo I think most, if not, yeah, most uh, power defense Asia games have these types of enemies. I mean, yeah, just the blunderbuss or up close triple shots into the face deal with. <laughs> Deal well with them. Oh, wrong spell. Yo, this spell I did seem to be might be very useful. Yeah. Freeze. I think I just made an ice nova. Okay, next wave is already here. All right, let's put uh, some traps over here then. Barricade up! More enemies on the way! Okay, I didn't see if they are coming from both sides here. Okay, so it reloads up to a set amount of shots. No matter if you swap it out or not. This time, I have to say, <laughs> with the numbers and just the enemy types, they throw them out a lot quicker in this one. Because in Orcs Must Die 2, they started you out with rock elementals, not rock lords. What's this? My trap set over here is doing quite a good work here. Yeah. We also use our weapons a little bit better now. But actually, we're yeah. using more shotgun than the bow. Yeah, I, I, I think. That yeah, the blunderbuss so probably does different. have the better DPS if you aren't getting consistent headshots. Yeah, it seems headshots are a bit tricky on this one. Yeah, especially right. since a lot of the time they're here, they're walking away from us and. It seems that we can't actually get headshots on, on the back of their heads. <laughs> yeah. Right. Let's see here. We can improve this. Okay. That'll work. This will send them in a bit longer. Actually, yeah. If I if we get enough money, we could probably start zigzagging them around here. Mm, actually, no. That'll that, that, that won't cool work. That may work yeah. one to one of them, but it's still a good idea. Yeah, it would, so, it would block the other end off, so they'd start attacking the barricades here. Yeah, it, it rather just have, have to, at least the other side forced to zigzag. Yeah. Then there'll be less... There'll be a problem later. Which means that if they are coming from both sides, we'll have more time to deal with one side before the other. But, 
It'll probably be a good idea to move your traps over now. But we should, uh, uh, wait, the do those... area where you had them. Those other ones, uh, wait, did you sell them? Yeah. You. What have I done you? They'll have to go, all of them will have to go through here, so it'll be better to put them here. Oh, oh yeah, we can. I keep forgetting the only, one. The only annoyance here. might be that since there is a half square of space, some might not get hit and such. Yeah, but they may get hurt by other things, mm. so to speak. And I don't I don't want to risk making this too short or too, uh, too narrow. Otherwise, the ogres will start attacking the barricades. So I'll move this one over a bit. Not much better. Let's see. I could move these over a bit more, but I don't want to risk the ogres reaching through the rest of it. Ready to go. And I just had a very mean idea. Uh, oh damn it! There's no roof here. Are you going to put up one of those gravity things? Yep. Yes. <laughs> oh, this is mean. <laughs> well, that's the whole thing. That's the whole reason for this game to be mean against orcs. It it isn't called cuddle or you know, uh, <laughs> it isn't mean. You know, that, it isn't named cuddle you know, orcs <laughs> or orcs must true. be cuddled or hugged. Very true. Okay. Uh Still plenty of coin, and I can then use them as for this then. Okay. This will catch them off guard. Mm, yeah, we'll have a perfect firing line into the group from here. All right. So for now, and it'll I'm probably ready. still be a good. And I got. Oh no. I've got 69 coin left. <laughs> I swear yeah. that number is following me around. Okay, Cobalt's first. Rocklings just seem to completely ignore us. They want to act like cobalt runners. Alright, time for this. Okay, so those traps do work against kobolds. Uh, Alright, uh, I think we wasted all of that mana because it didn't kill the big one. Because you were up close, and it, it's the smallest ones that ignore us. There we go. Now they come from both sides. So, time to make it a little zigzaggy thingy here, then? I can't really. I, I can put one down there. Yeah, they, they really made the barricades a, a lot more expensive to, to prevent you from using them too much. But then again, here I am spending every single coin I have on them. So yeah, that, that won't do much. Hmm. They 
might still be a little soft in comparison. Or quiet. Hmm. I'm busy here. <clears throat> Pardon again. Forgiven. Totally right. Oh yeah, I can do this as well. It would cost a lot, but uh, anything that slows them down and hurts them is welcome. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Ready? I guess I will have to later put more ice here and fire. Just, just because. All right. Where are they starting? Okay, no cobalts. And yeah, this, the blunderbuss also, of course, has the uh, added effect of re uh, ragdolling them with the secondary fire. Yeah, it, it also has some bit of AOA and cobalts. Yeah. So it, it's air, the the area it does deal damage in seems to be a lot smaller. Okay, now we get to the fun. Pretty sure those should have been landing as headshots as well, but okay. That's a put the barricade to use. Ogre or ogres. I was using the old button again. Why is that one charging? Okay, now the other side is coming in. Last wave. Okay, this is going much smooth, smoother this time. Smoother? You know what I mean. <laughs> uh, I, I don't think you'll want to kiss the ogres. They'll probably want to kiss you with the... If, if by kiss you means hit you with their clubs. Second side is coming in already. And I prepared several new traps. Oh, I didn't expect that Earth Elementals could get pulled up by those. I still don't get why some of why the orcs say it's like a movie theater for. <laughs> are they are they talking about the floor being greasy or something there? Because in some cases that is would be that would be accurate, yeah. Those gravity pillars are proving a lot more useful than I thought they would ever be. 
Oh yeah, yeah, they are, especially in combining with other traps like spikes and such. Like a spike trap under them and they drop them back down, that will hurt. Yeah, or have them above the yeah, towers to slow them down even further. Not today, buddy. Oh, well, at least one of them is going into the acid. Okay. Left lane coming in. Should, since they stay active for a while and don't just lift up the only uh, the first one to pass through. Oh, it's active all the time. No, but when it, when it is set off, it uh, stays on for a little bit. Oh, well, okay, that a, is a fair few seconds. So it, yeah, I was expecting it to only pull off one at a time or something like that. That kind of makes it very good then. Yeah. Sounds, yeah, if it was a kill though, at least if you slow them down to at least pack them up. Yeah, especially above Tar. <laughs> Just the noises they make. <laughs> oh. I could probably save, yeah, uh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Oh, Earth Lord is it coming through? And that's going to be the last of it. Okay, yeah, definitely should have started here from the first place. Yeah, this went way smoother than the last time. Yeah. Okay, four extra skulls. Putting me back up to eight. No, actually, no, plus three, so 11. Oh! Okay. To campaign. We didn't make part time, but uh, I'm good with that. Uh, now, let's see if I can upgrade right. something. The archers! Okay, then. Okay, level eight now. Let's see, uh, what? you got the arches unlocked? Yep. Okay, so we can start using those now. Because they, they, these are pretty good used... No, they, the arches have been pretty good throughout the entire series, I'd say. If used in a bunch of them. And they, you can upgrade, you can give them a unique upgrade to deal fire damage. And the tar pit, or the, the tar trap, pit or whatever. They can be upgraded to increase fire damage whilst they are, whilst enemies are on top of them. So they are a very good combo. Now though... There. Back down to three skulls that I can use. Wait. I can upgrade to the... Any enemies that are on fire in Tor get takes more fire damage. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah, with three skulls, I can't really upgrade anything much more. Maybe the blunderbuss. Increase the reload. No. The bow. Nope. Hmm. Maybe I should not have been putting skulls into upgrading that, but I could just reset it. But then I'd have to calculate what I have. <laughs> what I would gain out of that again. Okay. Yeah, if I were at this level, it should be pretty easy. We can just block off pots and focus down one pot, uh, one of them. So yeah, Brandon, when you are. Yep, mm. I'm ready. Okay. 
made a bunch of upgrades. <laughs> yeah. Guardian Archer. Medium range unit committed to defending Order Rift deals physical damage. So, Vorwick was just as powerful as Master Cygnus? Yes, though they were very different. Master Cygnus could do things Vorwick could not. But like Egan, Vorwick was born with innate magical abilities. Wait, what now? Those differences could have made their friendship stronger. Instead, it tore them apart. Hold up, can we get back to that bit about me? Later, the orcs approach. Seriously? <laughs> Okay, I'd forgotten this up here before, where we can check out each of the enemies. We have the Heavy Orc, Heavy Enemy, weak against Arcane and Elements, strong against Headshots and Physical Damage. Medium Orc, Light Enemy, weak against Arcane and Elements. Light Orc, weak against Arcane and Elements. Uh, Orcher, Medium Ranged, same as the others. But now we also get the Trolls. Very heavy enemy that regenerates health. Weak against fire, lightning, and headshots. Strong against ice and physical damage. And the ogre, very heavy enemy, charges and stuns targets. Weak against fire, ice, and headshots. Strong against physical. And the cobalt runners. Light enemy, fast, weak against fire and lightning. I do like that they added in elemental weaknesses and strengths. And not just for the fire and ice ogres, if we even get to see those in this game. I don't. I'm not sure. I I haven't seen them pop up yet. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, we, have, we have three doors leading down two pots. And luckily these are reasonably easy to block off. Just just like that. Yeah, we, they have one short point area as well over here where we started that. Seems to be the short point. Mm, no, because the other two can just go right around around it. Because we uh, have oh. here and on the sides. Okay, now okay, now I see. Now I see. Now I see. I so, see yeah. the barrels. We can just choke up this part with traps. Well, what are you waiting for? Lock it up. <laughs> I can only put down this one now. Woo! Well, let's do this. Oh, okay. They have. Uh... <clears throat> Made them a bit sexy as the last time. <laughs> 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 and they they also have these paths uh, where they start on, which makes it a lot easier to well park them around instead of the more freeform way they were before with the guardians. And I think it might be smarter to point them the other way. Wait, oh, <laughs> they changed that now as well. Just use R to rotate. There we go. Okay. Right. We can put down a zigzag here later. But for now, yeah. this will have to do. Yeah, I guess I just have to. Okay. Ready when you are? I am ready now. I guess these spike traps and archers we do for now. Okay, that doesn't look like kobolds to me. How fast, so it's probably light ones. One of our gates. The door is down. And heavy. And orc archers. Okay, those are going to the other side, so we can ignore them for a minute. And there's our trolls. Mm, troll. We don't have a lot of experience with those yet. Oh, yeah. These guys are generating. I remember. Okay, now those are coming around. Oh, ogre in the back. Oh. Yeah. Come on. Oh. Oh. That was trivial. 
Go, bunch of them. I think we reloaded at the exact same moment there. <laughs> oh, leave those alone. Ah, that one went completely over. And that's one archer down. May they be revived uh, after each round. Yeah, that wasn't how they were in the last games, but I think they are here. You see, when they when the ogres start charging, I should swap to the ice amulets. Okay. Um... That's it. Okay. More enemies yeah, they are way. still expensive. Hey, for some reason the the magic bow shots goes through the barrier, but the blunderbusses don't. Let's go. Yeah. It'd be good to waste a few shots into a wall to trigger a reload. Take that hit. Also, we have now these fight cups against the trolls. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, for God's sake, I upgraded my fight traps range. Okay. And it seems your mate, your archer hasn't respawned. Actually, if well, I if I put away yeah. mine, I could put up another. Okay, my will respawn as quick. We have a pause for we, we, we didn't have a proper pause of the, the first one. Yeah. Okay, Re retreat back and let the fire traps help. Yeah, it's just raising and then the headshots seems to work. And yeah, they've Very respawned true. now. Okay. Wonderful. There. There. This will catch him off guard. Uh, do you have an arrow trap? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you have an arrow trap? You can put it um, here. No, I'd have to sell one of the barricades, and I already right. sold my archer. I think it would be better to put. The tar trap in front there. I have to put tar traps over here, right in front of the fire thing. Yeah, you had one behind it. Hmm. Should be good. Okay. All right, let's you do moved this. it. What level of all? Yeah, that, that tar trap was to slow them down for the archers to shoot. shoot. Yeah, I, I think up here it'll be a lot better for them with that. Oh well, ready? Yeah. Okay, now they're coming from the sides. More enemies on the way. Okay, we've got two big ones on another this side. Being attacked. Probably trolls. They yep. Another door. Here they come. I'll try to focus the big ones by freezing them and then getting headshots on them. For some reason it seems that the ogres' head shot hitbox for the head gets a lot smaller when they're frozen. Maybe, or maybe I just get them in bad positions.
Maybe we shouldn't have been like Bowser Jr. <laughs> what? Yeah. yeah, one of my one of my characters heard noises sounded a lot like a Bowser one of Bowser Jr.'s noises. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'll distract a few. Okay. And I'm chasing down the last of them. I need a bigger challenge. There we go. Okay, timed wave. So be quick. There. Okay, now archers would really be useful since they'll have they'll spend quite a bit of time walking around. Oh. I've got you. And don't come back. Did one of the kobolds just sound like a puppy getting kicked or something? Seems we accidentally set off uh, explosive barrels. Uh, no, no, I did intensely. I dropped the bomb on some frozen ogres. Okay, that explains He's why I saw one and suddenly didn't see one earlier. Yeah, it blew everything around them. The barricade is under attack. Peanut gallery. Oh yeah, this makes it easy for the archer to shoot them in midair. <laughs> See? Yeah, they, when they are pulled up, they literally become a target practice. Go. Hmm. Let's see. That's it. That's the last one. Okay, it seems they don't have much. They only really start shooting once they get here, or they might have been doing that only because it was a smaller target. Uh, let's see. Hmm. More enemies all the way! Yeah, it'll probably be better to guide them this way instead of through here because then they'll get. then they'll be out of range for a bit. Tell your friends! Oh, wait, you can't because you're dead. It takes quite a bit for the. Grenades to go off. <laughs> Cobalt changed his mind, looked the last second, but too late. Bye bye. Okay, and the an ogre torso is turned into Sonic for a second. <laughs> <laughs> it just came rolling, rolling, rolling over. Targets. A barricade is under attack. No, its trap system is working mighty fine. Yeah. They're attacking a barricade. Okay, bunch of big boys. Yeah, yeah. That lost uh, out sound 
really sounds like freaking Bowser Jr. Oh. I'm almost down. Um, healing. Okay. Stragglers. And the last one. Definitely we could set up a trap over here, then they'll have to pass by that, at least, uh, then they'll have to pass by that twice. Now, let's see. Um, we can shorten this a bit. Putting that there. Actually, if we do this... Should be good. Mm. This, would, this would work a lot better if the arches had more range. But it'll keep them in a straight line for us, mostly. And I'll add another archer to the mix. I'll, I'll, it might be better to move them up some. Where would we be able to move them up to, is the question. Mm -hmm. Behind the flame traps. Actually... Wait. I think we can put them near the damn rift. Yeah, you could put them up there, but they'll also get attacked there. Uh, point taken. So yeah, if we put these three up front here as well, they'll start they'll start shooting earlier as well. There's only one small weakness at the moment with this uh, maze, that, that there isn't a barricade up here. So if this one gets smashed, then the left lane or the, the left gate can bypass a lot. All right, ladies, look mean. That includes you, Hillian. You forgot one. I already moved them. Oh. No, no, you, you put... I thought that was yours I could not move. There we go. Let's do this thing. I'm ready. Wait. Bunch of balls. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> some of the kobolds really sound like puppies when you kill them. Or I think that's a puffy-ish noise, and where the hell was that one going? I need a bigger challenge. Nope. Okay, yeah, they start shooting at quite a lot earlier now. I see you two there. Keep an eye on my health. Maybe I'm just catching the ogres in a bad position. I think you might want to move over here instead. Where the actual concentration is. <laughs> I am shoot flanking them at the moment. Well, I'm coming. They're attacking a barricade. 
Not so tough now. <laughs> Yeah, the, flanking them with the bow doesn't really matter much if you're just shooting in the back where they, you can't get headshots. I was flanking them with a the shotgun! And grenades. I cannot put a few that over there. There's the archers. Alright, that's why I was there. I wanted to make sure I could... Get rid of the damn archers. There we go. Um. Yeah, miss. Ah, screw that one up. Oh well. More enemies on the way. Okay, left lane big. I didn't mean to start hovering. Probably best if I don't stand there. Okay, now the big boys are coming out in numbers. I think you might need to move over here because they're pushing me back. Oh, you're already here. And, oh, but did, did they kill all the archers? Damn it. I would say it's just one, but yeah, it, it's our, their own archers that are doing it here, it seems. Yeah. They can get too close at the corner there. Why are, why are they, are they all stuck? Uh, why are they? Okay, uh... Why were they all stuck there, there for a bit? Yep, and I'm down. Just as I'm about to swap to it. The barricade is down! Okay, why are they getting stuck there? They didn't put up a barricade to block their path. And I think you might want to move right here. Okay. Now I think it's a, one of the bugs. Now, I think they might be getting confused because of this barricade that I misplaced. Either way, we've got that dealt with, but yeah, they, they seem to be getting bunched up here for some reason. Okay. It looks like they got a bit too many at once, they could have time problems and uh, problems will get past each other. And we got a high score for that. Nice. As well as another seven skulls, so back to ten. Hmm? We got an archer group outpost. Ah, uh, yeah, because the next uh, the next one, uh, the next mission, is another war scenario. And for this one, um, I failed to look up how much it actually did. I get it or not? Uh, to, let's see, mega boom barrel. Where is it? There we go. Rapid-fire ballista. I'm buying this one. So, 
down to four again. Okay. Because, yeah, we're dealing with another war scenario. And that war machine is pretty useful, if you ask me. Now, let's see. I can't upgrade those any further. So, upgrades my horses will heal over time and have more health. And up. Okay, zero scores because I upgraded the blunderbuss's reload. Yep. Okay. No. This should give us another cinematic, I think. Maybe. Or not, Master okay? Sickness and Vorwick would fight one more battle together before the end. Why won't you understand, Sickness? The orcs need a master to shape their single-minded stubbornness into obedience. Vorwick, old friend, any control would be temporary. See the orcs for what they are, an unstoppable force of nature. What I see, old friend, is that you refuse to share your power and help me protect the Order. If that is truly your goal, look to the defense of this rift. They are coming. Okay. And immediately I drop into the freaking... <laughs> into the freaking modes. Remember me? <laughs> yeah. We're dealing with a simple... Yeah, simple design. Two lanes. So I'm just going to block off the shorter one as far back as possible of course wait that are they using wait what what are those black holes on the map mm -hmm. those are the <clears throat> those are the uh, teleport gates so we can move around quickly um Tell me if I understand the map right but is it telling me that the orcs are using the teleport gates no, they no, they can't. You can look at the ghosts and the dots in the mini map for where they're going. Yeah, that's 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 why I'm asking. It looks like it's, they are entering one of them. Yeah, they're they're stopping at one of them because they see the path ahead is completely blocked on the right side. If you look close, you can also see them walk back from it. That's they, on your side, yes, we would barricade, but where I'm standing, they are not. Hmm. Oh, I see what's going on. Yeah, it's the gate. gate. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to need to put traps in front of that. Uh, I think the better place for the moment will be to fire down the lane here. Uh, let's see. Bank yeah, of gonna... Archers. Can I see if I can find you? Okay. Wait, what? Oh, I'm so confused. Hmm? Uh, okay, this where's the... Okay. Are you, are you having trouble getting out? Yes. You uh, can't just jump, you know. Over this distance? Onshore. Get over hey. here. Uh, wait, wait. Should I put archers up here? Uh, the, the archer tower, I mean. Yeah, the, art, the, the outpost thing doesn't really work. I'm not sure if you have the same war machines as I have. They should. But you could put banks of archers there, yeah? Though they are less accurate, uh, they're more bombardment than straight up. They're, they're more doing bombardment shooting than uh, the, a single archer would. They prefer it. They are a lot less uh, accurate, but yeah, since it's a freaking ton of them, it also shoots a lot more. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, why do you put a catapult in the middle of the road? Because they'll be walking towards it. Here's where they will fall. 
And so if I have a choke point to shoot at... What do we... What the... Okay! Yeah. <laughs> it's a also, machine gun ballista. Yeah, and uh, you should probably put a... One of those... Uh, Palip traps on that bridge? And flip them into the water? Uh, if they're... Actually, yeah, I should move it back a bit. Because if if I were to set a flip trap here, it would throw them at the archers. <laughs> exactly. This there. And then one, two... I need more oh, I'm, I'm short on that, but I'll... We should be able to survive the a first round. And in general, they'll still be going down in one lane. So yeah, I'm ready. Um, go, go, come over and see if I can... Wait, where are the teleporters you spoke about? The, the green gates you can see on the map. On the other side of the wall of where you are now. Oh, I'm the... Wait, time to yawn. Oh, I did it! Yay! Yeah, that... By the great hmm. Yeah, after the first round, we can probably remove those and put down tar traps and, well, finish the, off the line of barricades. Mm -hmm. And maybe start zigzagging from here. I'll have to move back the ballista. But, yeah, this should do for the first right wave. Yep. <laughs> Red or yellow dots? I don't remember anything about yellow dots in the minimap. But yeah, you can oh, see how are? these arches fire differently than the normal ones. That's quite a range! Yeah. I, thought, I should probably put up more of them there. But it does mean that at short range they have a lot less accuracy. Yeah, they, they are a lot better for bombarding than just uh, st shooting them down rapidly. For that, <laughs> I'm do currently doing it. I don't think a shotgun is going to do much at this distance. So I could, I could replace one of the... Okay, there's a bit of a gap. Jumping out for a second. Actually, I know I can't sell at the moment. Okay. Yep, pro bolts. Seriously, what is with those yellow dots? It's not the trolls. What are those? I can't really see <laughs> what they might be, be behind all of the uh, coin pop-ups. Okay. Oh. I think I've seen well, well, well. Those dynamite archers could pose a problem. Yes. Remember to fight them far from any barricades. Those are dynamite archers. Yeah, we want to keep a distance from those. Yeah, they just want me to not stand close to the barricades when they come about. Yeah, oh, uh, the other the other side is still coming. Actually... Oh, not, not where I expected that to go. Probably should have expected it to go there. I'll come back, though. I see them turning around. Uh, yeah, I'm going to sl I'm going to put up a quick bar uh, ballista to try and actually no, I can't remove that. Hmm. I think they hit one of my archer groups. Yeah, I, I did see one of the archers get off some shots. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I'll put down a secondary ballista at the corner there. And 
yeah, they cleared out one of your yeah, one of your yeah, guardians. Bastards. Okay. Getting back for the blister. There we go. Yeah, we're the well enough designed and planned uh, tra well, <laughs> trap maze. The difficulty of this game can vary quite a bit. And, okay, I was going to ask, are any of those shots going to hit that single orc? <laughs> Missed like six of them around him. Okay, other side. Is Actually, I have more than enough. Yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to teleport up to the front here, then cross, and put down a ballista here to thin out their numbers before they get back here. I, I, actually, no, I can't afford one. I, okay, then I'll just thin them out myself. <laughs> Since they're in a conga line, uh, what happened? A broken leg! Fly like heck. <laughs> okay, yeah, now in English, please. <laughs> it's flying! Like they're trying to fly to the moon! Oh, yeah. I just... Oh, grenade! I just... Oh. Nothing misses it is a goofy scream. <laughs> I just screenshot it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, hello, oh, everyone. Hello. Hey, Ram. And hello there in the chat, chilling at uh, no tilling Saturn. Yeah, they are di dynamite archers. Yeah, I have no idea what you're doing. Yeah, I can't see it. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's because we're we're doing co-op now, so there's no need to screen share. I I can start it up quick. Oh. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. So okay. funny thing. I bought Borderlands, Borderlands 2, and the pre sequel with all of the oh, DLC. Okay. And, and all of that was just one wave, apparently. Huh. Mm. Go figure. So, oh, yeah. yeah, I can play co op Borderlands if, you know, you need a partner. Okay, um. I haven't, I don't have it on the two stream list at the moment, but we could put it up there. Uh, I know. Oh, I'm still now. I need to remove that barricade now. Uh, but yeah, I, I have. I think all of the Borderlands games, not every little bit of DLC. And I'm not sure if I have three. I might have it. Uh, okay, do you have the barricades equipped? Nope. Okay. Then put that back. That gap, little. That gap will remain for a moment. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, we're, we're currently playing Orcs Must Die 3 and we're in a war scenario, which is, well, bigger machines, bigger numbers of Orcs. Okay, this should have a good sight. They might come at me with this now, though. Hmm. Anyway, we'll find it out. Uh... Came to let you know that. Oh, by the way, dips on Roland because that's like the <laughs> one character I know how to play. Okay. <laughs> and Axe too. The pre sequel we could just do whatever because I've never played that one. Okay, you, you prefer the soldiers, simply put. Yeah. One small in okay. the breach. I I I think I have only. On my own playthrough, on my solo playthroughs through the game, I think I have only been using the soldier classes as well, but it'll be nice to try out different ones. There's a uh, Berserker, there's a uh, Siren, there's always a Siren. Yeah, I, I've pl I've, I haven't played through pre-sequel, but I have finished one and two. Actually, no, pre-sequel is the only game that doesn't have a Siren on it as a playable g character. Yeah, from what I remember hearing about it, it doesn't, yeah. Okay. 
But it ha but it allows you to play as Handsome Jack's doppelganger if you want to. I think Claptrap as well. Yes, you can also play as Claptrap. <laughs> okay, ready when you are, Drakira? Since I'm, I'm not gonna stay for long, More like, enemies I'm, gonna the leave. Way. I'm gonna leave and say good luck to the both of you against the orcs. <laughs> Thanks Thank and uh, good luck with the dog. <laughs> Whatever good, dog that might be. That's not a dog, that's my mom laughing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I want to say that's a bottom off Indian. <laughs> uh, I'm too used to just small dogs and just barking stuff because of family. <laughs> yeah, well, whatever. See you guys for as you want tomorrow. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> See ya. Be safe. Yeah, I'll be safe. Okay. We do know now that those yellow dots on the mini map are the dynamite arches. So yeah, we need. We need to keep an eye out for those. And maybe move our defenses forward. Uh, has this... I don't think the big flipper has gone off any... Uh, at all. Is this a change? And he flipped and he the face through reality. into the water! Okay, I'll try to keep an aim on the big guys, then you can deal with the smaller ones. And yeah, as you can see, these arches are not that great up <clears throat> at short distances. Because there's... Yeah, you could see it right there. They're, <laughs> they, their shots are spread out like they're... Yeah, freaking helms deep. can't actually see what I might be hitting or not at this distance. Okay. It doesn't really matter. As long as green... <laughs> as long as all the green before us is grass and not orc, it's all good. And I see dynamite archers. Okay. Run and grab the money. I'm swooping over. Distract him at the back. Actually, if we set down a flipper here where they could, they would pass over it twice. Okay, here we go. And here they come in a neat little line ready to get shot. And apparently annoy one of the ogres <laughs> the acupuncture. Okay, are they going to come for me now? No, they are not. Okay. I'm, I'm still considered far enough away for them to not come at me. Or if I ignore these pills enough. Okay, dynamite arch is dealt with. You've got only the scraps to deal with now. I missed all of those freaking kobolds. No, okay. oh, that was the... Was that a flipper that I heard? No. No, they didn't get past the... the yeah, the barricades. But the, no, it's, it's in front of the... A kobold was the flipper of almost all these spike traps. <laughs> in a very cinematic manner. <laughs> run, kobold, run. Yeah, I see that. Well, several spikes <laughs> rose up behind them. Okay, grabbing some cash, and I'm going to put down a flipper. <clears throat> Pardon? Yet again. Hmm. You've been pardoned. Okay. All right, are you right over there? Yeah, I put down a flipper at the start there. So by the time that any of them might be coming back, it'll have reset for certain. Shortening this one by one. 
Ok. Hmm. Oh, I see what you did here. Let's see, I have enough for two more barricades, or I could put up another flipper. So, let's see. Uh, Wait, I just have an idea. Why not flip them so they fall back into the traps? Could work, but it, it'll be easier to get them killed. Uh, to just throw them into the sea or the moat. Yeah, it's not really a sea <laughs> if it's just a moat. <laughs> okay. Kind of curious what would happen if I throw them, if we throw them onto the rocks here. If they'll just face through it like they the one <laughs> singular one did here. I guess time to tell. Yes, I am prepared. Okay, here come a bunch. <laughs> God, the entire time there's been a bunch of them. Okay. All right. And there goes the flipper because I see a lot of red dots suddenly <laughs> flying off of the lane. <laughs> And... <laughs> okay, I did not expect them to get flipped that high. Yeah, they, they got killed when they go so warm. <laughs> okay. And there it went again. Okay, why did... Oh, the sound went down. The sound of the ballista went down there for a second. Okay. Rock elementals now. No, it's not, it's not rock elementals, it's earth elementals. than clay elementals by them this time. <laughs> okay, I think we've about exhausted the left lanes. me <laughs> okay hmm. it, it might actually be better if I set up a ballista over there for you to use I just put up the more arches over there <laughs> <laughs> okay hmm. not actually that many okay was that a kobold trying to sound like Taz <laughs> A bunch of rock, a bunch of elementals coming. Okay, just there we go. <laughs> Stall them a bit on that. Why was that one? Um, okay, what were they coming back here? I, I got one of them, but I, not the one I was aiming for there. Why are... Okay. For some reason, some of the Earthlings are actually moving backwards. For the order. Or they turn around when they don't need to. Okay. Power traps? Hmm. Let's see. 
I don't really think we need to put up more barricades or anything because they're just not getting close at all. So instead, I'll just put up a bunch of archers here. Meet them with force. Oh, I did not see there's a ramp here. We'd never miss. Oh, yeah, they, 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 they seem reluctant to go up that though. Luckily enough. Okay. I would save some money for in case, just to see if I can afford more archers. Hmm. And just because you suggested it, I'm going to pour down a flipper that <laughs> sends him back up the lane. A master's war machine. <laughs> now that would be mean just for them to fall. Fly and land on more deadly traps. Right? Ready, boss? Yeah. Hmm. And we're almost at two hours again. Hmm. <laughs> and where, the, where the heck was that patch of archers shooting to? That's like they were shooting towards the castle. Okay. There is the other ballista if you want to go and use it. Wait, where do you put it? In the opposite corner. So in the upper right. It's across from your arches over there. You can use the portal behind us. And then we'll risk trying across the green sea. Oh, and I think some troll. Yeah, some trolls are going after your archers. I, I, yeah, I see them. I just kill them. Okay. What? Something that the uh, <clears throat> the batch archers seem to uh, make up for with their make up for their inaccuracy with is a lot more damage since. It, it seems that each arrow there does get a kill. Hmm. Maybe it would have been better if I put down a ballista there, so we can fire at them both at the, from both ends. Yeah. That would be yeah. much better. Yeah, we, we still have one wave to go. Hmm. Okay. Uh, you could run across and get to the ballista now if you want. Hmm. No, uh, uh, Not oh. really, Baluk of Things. Uh, thank you for following, uh, Thai Wisdom. Now you could try putting up a baluster behind the arches there. We, we, you might have enough coin. Actually, you don't have it unlocked, so you can't. Uh, I'll go. I'll run over quick and put give you one. Uh, there's not enough space. <laughs> okay, you could you could cross over now. There's uh, only a single line of red dots, and he goes straight through him. I love kobolds. Okay, uh, in chat, uh, hi wisdom. Uh, what's up, fam? Saw you from the Discord. What is this? Is Orcs Must Die Three, uh, which was, which was a Stadia exclusive for a year, and uh, yeah, we uh, quite a while ago, I we were planning on playing through the entire series in a row. About so we. I played through Orcs Must Die 1, which is only single player. We played through Orcs Must Die 2, which has co-op as an option. So it, it definitely seems to be balanced towards co-op, at the very least. And that was the last one. So, yeah, it's a tower defense game, sort of. Um, yeah. Alright, okay. let's see if we can put it over here now, instead. Yeah, I removed one of your... Uh, 
left remove one of your bands. Or yeah, what is do it? Let's remove the other one that you put over there. Oh, wait, can I do that? Yeah, you can sell it. All right, and there's money over here. Yeah, just gathering it up. This looks like a sick it's like a defense game, yeah. Uh, that's awesome, I love games like that. De def I definitely advise de this series. Yeah, just from start to finish, it is a fun series. De this one ha... It's this one, uh, the reason we didn't continue with this one immediately after we'd finished with Orcs Must Die 1 and 2 is because, yeah, it was, it was only just released from the Stadia exclusivity and, yeah, bugs galore. Yeah, I so, love about it. It had been reused, but there was a lot of bugs going on. Okay. Here, can I... One thing to keep in mind now at the moment, though, is that these these are the war scenarios exclusive to this game. Most of them levels will be a lot more you know, will be a lot smaller without the war machines in the low in the lower right corner. Okay, I'm gonna run back into the damn castle. Now you know you could just jump over here. Not from <laughs> that. The, jump from castle over to you, sure, but not the other way around. And he went through a portal so I couldn't show up in front of him. But yeah, we have to defend these rifts. Show us the okay. There we Let's... go. What was. Oh, that was that noise. A <laughs> big freaking grinder. Oh, yeah, I forgot okay. to tell you. It seems to have a very deadly grinder to use in there. Yeah. Let's see. Time of wisdom. I'm just waking up at the moment, but I'm still watching as I get ready. Thank you for watching all the same, even if it were at in the middle of night or in early in day. Just having people watch is nice enough on its own. What? I can put traps over here like this? Okay. All right. I will do this then. I'll... I guess. All right. Hmm. That should do for now. I will put more traps over there as I get more money. If need to be. Yeah, you mean at the bottom of the road, uh, of this ramp here, you mean? Yep, I can put them on the ramp as well, but it looked damn weird. Oh, yeah, I do th that. I oh. think that'll okay, be a lot more easier. Better. That's way, actually, way better. Hmm. Yeah, yes. Okay, it does yeah. seem that the archers do block some of the arrows, but you should still be able to shoot over them. Yeah, and I'll probably be aiming at another direction as well. Let's see. Right, Bernie? Yeah. Let's have fun. More enemies on the way! And a boss, Gorbash. Hmm. Gorbash ingratiates us with his presence. Stupid indeed, but he will try and destroy any barricades we have. Oh, I see a star moving across the map. Is that him? Yes, that's him. He has two oh. hammers. Okay, best to... Oh, uh, that actually means that he's going, he's going straight for the barricade protecting you. The barricades. Yeah! <laughs> well, that was bad timing, the putting those down. No, he only, he only broke them! It's <laughs> now... <laughs> it made an easy pin cushion out of him. Let's see, is this a free-to-play or how much... I, it's not free-to-play, there might be a demo. Demos have been uh, getting more and more in use lately. But it's not a full... If I recall correctly, it's not a full $60 uh, dollar game, or 60 euro game. It is cheap. Yeah, I believe the price is around 25. Don't quote me on that, I might have it wrong. I think it's a bit cheaper, but, but is it 25 or 26? Yeah, a, a lot cheaper than uh, the recent Call of Duties and such, at the very least. 
Uh, also, uh, do tell me if the audio might seem off. Uh, what I'm seeing in my streaming program on the side, OBS, is that the audio of the game seems to be a lot lower than, the, uh, than it would be compared to other games that I've uh, streamed. I see a lot of red dots flying on the right side of the minimap. <laughs> and there's a bonus call on, out on the field. And yeah, we. <clears throat> After that, uh... Okay, perfect. That's good to hear. Yeah, because, yeah. Audio is always something I sort of have to worry about with the games at times. Because audio mixing can always be a big pain in the ass. Okay. Straggler. Okay. Did I actually sell the, the list on the other side or did I not? I did. Okay, okay yeah. Threat yeah. I'm just going to charge out front and get that skull before it like, get lost. Because those skulls are currency for unlocking and upgrading stuff. And the heck? Why the hell was there a big red lane? Okay, oh, I think that's probably a bit of a glitch. The, yeah, the. For some reason, the health bars of the archers are getting caught by the mini-map. The heck? <laughs> okay. Anyways, let's pick off the stragglers. No, earth elementals. I forgot to check if... What the weaknesses of the Earth Elementals are, actually. Probably physical damage, since they are more mystical, so they'd likely have a bigger... Uh, ...magic defense. <laughs> and, yeah, the characters do a silly dance every, <laughs> at every victory. Yeah, they, they used to do more mix, uh, different dances. Now they are doing only one dance. Yeah. <laughs> Nine skulls for me to use. So... Back to the campaign. And we are... Hmm. So, shall we go a bit longer today? Because this this will actually catch me up to where I'd gone uh, with a different friend of mine. Actually, we have I haven't started this mission yet. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, typically, I stream for two hours. And yeah, 10 p.m. here would be the two-hour mark. But yeah, the, this, this, the indoor maps take a lot less time. But, uh, very nice. I'll definitely have to check it out. Okay. Uh, yeah, coastal hallways. I haven't tried this mission yet. And we'll get a new enemy type here. The Cobalt well, Bombers. And a different type of Orc Archer. Either way. Uh, I have nine oh, to spend. Those are, the, those are the Bomb Archers from the last level. Yeah, yeah. Could... Oh, yeah, we'll definitely have to keep an eye out on those. Uh, let's see. Probably best if I up... Actually, should I upgrade the archers? I'm mostly focusing on barricades to... Let's see how to word this. Yeah, with, with a lot of these... Tower defense games, you know, actually, as someone who plays, you know, says to play them, you probably notice, but a lot helps by just having, by slowing down your enemies, and that's what these barricades are used for. And, yeah, I, I mostly do the barricade work, and Drakir puts up the damage traps, so I'm not really sure if it would really help if I upgrade my other traps as much, since, well, most of my stuff is going towards the barricades anyways. Instead, let's see, as protect. I'll, I'll upgrade my weapons. Reload, that, I forgot to see how many skulls that was, I think it was four. 
So now we have five available. I say I have five available even though I have a lot more here because I only earned uh, so many skulls through the playing with your gear here and I don't want to over get overpowered by just using my <laughs> vast resource of skulls already. Okay, let's see what will be new now. Spike ball, slap. I, yeah, that's the timer going off or... No, that was not. The heck was that then? Never mind. Spike wall slaps enemies with physical damage and throws them back depending on their size. Not long after that battle, Vorwick disappeared. There were rumors that Master Cygnus banished him from the Order, afraid of what he might do. So, uh, what was the point of that story again? The gigantic orc army's genius. They haven't been seen since the days of Master Cygnus and Vorwick, and now they're back. Kelsey has it right. These new Red Rifts are bringing smaller orc factions together to create armies not seen since Vorwick's time. We've got this, sorceress. Let's trap it up. Okay, we've got quite a few lanes for them to go through here. Hmm. Yeah, do. Okay, which is which the one longest? Is the do we have one? Let's see. I think I think going on the right here, or the left, might be the longest way that they can go. Or actually, no. I think either this path. Or the other one here might be. Hmm. Okay. Oh, there's more than one way for them to get up here, ain't it? Yeah. So yeah, let's block off so they only have one way. And I, I've already spent all of my coin. Let's. Hmm. Yeah, at the very least, I think I'll shut down the left side here. And then we'll deal with what uh, with yeah with those that come through this way because they still have to go up these stairs, no matter if they go straight or take a turn. Let's see: light orc, medium orc, heavy orc, orc archer, ogre. Cobalts, Earth Lord, very heavy, breaks into Earth's elementals when destroyed, weak against arcane and ice. Okay, strong against headshots and physical. Earthling, same. Earth elemental, same. And yeah, the Cobalt Sappers. Light enemy, fast attacks barricades, weak against fire and lightning. And the Dynamite Arches, yeah. Fast explosive arrows, medium range, weak against arcane and elements. And the Trolls again. Oops, okay. Ready? Yeah, we'll need we'll need to catch those sappers when they come charging in because yeah, they're going to open up extra parts for them to go through. Off we go. Hmm. Oh yeah, ready. Yeah. We might need to set up some traps that the sap yeah, that are fast enough to catch the sappers. Probably should have equipped a magic weapon, since I only have the bow and the blunderbuss. preparing to breach one of our gates. The door is down. Typically, sappers make a very uh, obvious noise when they spawn, though. But not always. Oh, ogre, ogre. Let's freeze you and then get him some free headshots. Oh, normal kobolds, not much of a threat. Except being a nuisance. They're almost there! Uh you missed some They're entering the rift. Wait. Did I put the traps on the wrong end? Yeah. Wait, no, they, they, they came over here as well. 
Yeah, but they split up. Because they... Oh. There's a split in the pot. <laughs> okay. Show me what this split is. Yeah, right here. Here's the split. Oh. Okay. Let's see then. I'm going to put these barricades at the very back. Okay. Here. Okay, we we really I'm guessing this will be the round where they will release the sappers. Let's see. I like how your character can fight them off too. It reminds me a lot like egg like, dungeon defenders with but way better graphics too, yeah. <laughs> It also makes it a little more in interactive since you can actually, well, interfere with the enemies and such. And I've blocked off the back of this part so they won't be going... Well, they, they'll be going this way, but then they'll be heading back through. But these Did will go unopposed. Yep. Oh, love of Odin Hillian! Don't give me hints! Right, where should I put them then? What are you doing? Don't hide away from me! Yeah, okay, show me. What should I put the traps? What? You can here. put them from anywhere between here and the stairs, basically. After this, I'll start uh, mazing up the pathway here. Or doubling up on these, just in case any sappers get through. One little, one little thing that extra that might be nice on a possible Orcs Must Die 4 is a preview of which enemies will be coming from which doors. Dungeon Defenders has that, but hmm, not really sure if that would really add because then you could typically you end up. Hmm. Now with Dungeon Defenders, you had to deal with a lot more flying enemies as well. They are also in this game, but in Dungeon Defenders they were a lot more common, so you would have to know where they'd be coming from, so you could put down tourists to shoot them down. Hmm. Actually, yeah, it would still be helpful to know where the freaking flyers can come from at times. And actually... I'm trying to remember now from Orcs Must Die 2 if it showed where flying enemies would come from or not. Sort of, you could see the portals at times. Yeah, I, th I think they'd be marked on the map. Uh, if there were flies, that there'd be markers on the map to show where Our they could be coming from. Here they come! Right. Gotta keep in mind my mana. Right. Screw you. When did the orcs get American accents? <laughs> in the previous ones, they were a lot more British, I think. Yet. This is surprising. I think so far, when a oh. new enemy types have shown up, they've, tipped, they've shown up on the second wave so far. And again, this one wave isn't over yet. Yeah, they probably want to give them some surprise. Yeah, or more of a uh, oh shit, oh shit, here they come, you know, surprise. Because we already saw them on the preview.
Okay, last one. That was trivial. Okay, no time for the rest. Um, up. Now I started here. Damn it. Nope. Ice. Yeah, that was the sound. And they were. Okay. Hello. And they had bombs on their backs. Nice. Okay, they they made them a lot more identifiable by making them yellow, similar to the dynamite archers. That that, that, is, that is good design, because in, in yeah, the previous games I'll... they they would get lost in the crowds. The only way to identify them would be by their speed, and well, the big freaking fuses and bombs on their backs. What? One got in? There are enemies in our rift room. Uh, one, one enemy got in from the first wave. Okay. At the very least, if any, if any sappers get down this way, they'll blow up these barricades first, not the important ones. Nope. And still, we'll probably want to put down more of a maze here, since now a lot of them are just yeah, out coming here. They're attacking a barricade. Oh. Enemies at the rift. Okay, uh, it, they'll typically ignore the barricades unless, well, the archers are horrible shots. So if they're trying to shoot at someone behind the barricades, they can hit the barricades that way. Collateral damage that would be called probably. Just put away the magic bow. It is good, but not on this map. <laughs> yeah, in general, DPS, the blunderbuss has proven to be better. It, it, it is good for taking out big targets once you've frozen them. Uh, explosives coming in. More enemies on the way! Wonderful. Okay, I think I just painted the entire wall with them. If there were actual blood effects in this, you know, well, if there were lingering blood effects. Actually, there, there probably is a mod like that somewhere, and I see that yellow one at the back that is probably a dynamite archer. Hello, and get fucked. One of, one of the doors is still up. Bigger, small, I can take them all down. Okay. No lingering arches here. Okay. I see you've upgraded your own arches quite a bit. Yep. Pretty sure the healing one is uh, the last one they get. And they have healing or fire, and I. Healing sense effect, like that's probably more useful. Yep, yep. And they are with the health. So, yeah, they're doing quite good work over there. Yeah. There are enemies in our rift room. What? Now they might be getting a bit too close to the entrances. Yeah, looking good. There we go. She uh, should be able to help us out there. Uh, I think it's more a case of the announcer being a bit paranoid that, that when an or when when an orc gets to the front of the barricades that they start freaking out because they are so close to it. 
Oh, I'm reminded I put the ARs over here for anyone that does get past. For we have two that did get past here. Yeah. That must be controllable, I'm hoping. Okay, this is the last of them. Three, two, one, done. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Yeah, they're going to break open the last door now, because it's yellow. Hmm. Actually, I we have a I have a lot of coin at the moment, so I could put down. A few sacrificial barricades. And if the actually, not, I'll put them a bit free. further back. I would say free vehicle to pick up, uh, place up some arrow traps. Actually, yeah, those those would be good at setting them off. And if they are close enough to each other, they could chain react each other. <laughs> that so there. With Cobalt, it's good to aim towards where they'd be coming from. Since if they are diagonal or sideways to it, they can run past it. Let's see. Gonna share and get my day started, so you have an awesome rest of the stream. If you're live later, I'll definitely be back. To it. Thanks for watching. Uh, now, after this, uh, we'll call it. Because, yeah, it's, it's past 10 p.m. here now. Let's see. Mm -hmm. we always back. I'll, I'll leave that one there. Other than that, I'm not sure where it would, it would be best to put some traps to go for mm. sappers. Mm. I'll leave it at that. And I, I we, yeah, we can start mazing up the entrance here now. Hmm. There, and there, and no something this way. This. You made me stop! <laughs> Thank you! Also! Okay. Come back here so I can teach you a lesson! I, I think you said that you set up a cauldron. <laughs> No, I can't put that one Perfect fully placement. down. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I'll, I'll try to keep an eye out for any explosives coming in. And if I miss any, hopefully they will get caught by one of the you know, arrow traps. But otherwise, I'm done. Actually, the, uh, the gravity pillar traps would probably be very good at stopping them. Why do you think I put them over here? <laughs> I'll put one here. Okay, big boy coming in. Enemy hmm. forces are attacking! They breached another door! Oh, I yeah. There we go.
Oh, that's a lot of big ones. Oh yeah, there's, there's a whole party of or or ogres. No, nope, I, I actually dodged that one this time. You chill out. Get some acupuncture. Okay, they're all coming from this side now. Go, oh, bars. You go that way then, big boy. Uh, let's... Okay, I think this is most... Did they fly suddenly or something? Times wave. Um, I don't really. Hmm. Okay, just I'm just going to put down arrows. Hmm. Uh, okay, what are you stuck in the wall? I think you put one arrow cup at a one bad spot. Yeah, this last one here, I presume. This one here. If you put it here and stand now, it will be better. That's not a too big deal. Archers. Oh, oh, bombers, bombers, bombers. And bomb. Okay. And luckily they let out that war cry or whatever that's supposed to be. I'm guessing it's kamikaze in kobold. What screech? Yeah. And the barricade is under attack. Okay, some archers were dueling with your your archer. She won me mostly. My archers can heal themselves. But I should be dead. Yeah, they haven't died once, I think. They're returning now. Silly troll. Burn. Okay. And the last batch. Oh, she helps over here as well. Yeah. Well, I might as well give her some friends.
Nope. They're splitting, okay. And these guys are going to be extra to support you to find another dead end. And we don't get time to set up. No. Mm. Now. Oh, that's a bunch of them. They're attacking a barricade. Okay, that was a lot more of them than I expected oh. to find. A cobra's torso landed almost on me. <laughs> also, oh. we can move back. I got some uh, helpers to help out here. Just don't stand in the latest uh, fire. fire. Uh, I think they can shoot past us. Bombers. Oh dear. And they're dealt with. So how the hell do... Again, one of them came up with the, uh, like, a movie theater floor line. Uh, how the hell would Forge know what a movie theater is? That's a good question. Gravity pillars are proven to be very useful. <laughs> they have to upgrade mine. I think I noticed my mine have shorter reload. Okay, mine aren't upgraded. So yeah, I'll, I'll focus mostly on my barricades. And weapons. You can focus mostly Ooh. on the uh, traps. Or the no, no, traps. No, I'll just have more armor than before, besides a healing aura. Okay. So they don't only show much legs, they actually shame me in pants now. And a bit more green in the creations. Two stragglers, and it's the last way. Oh, and again, we don't get time. All right. They're, weird. They're trying to push us with this one. Actually, put that one down wrong. There we go. Fireworks all around. Oh, that killed one of Marcher's hit teams. Taking shots again somewhere, yep. Kobolds coming up the stairs. Can't reach them this time. Okay, they almost destroyed those. The barricade is under attack. Oh yeah, they're almost breaking through here because of collateral damage. Mm 
there. Okay, they're running back. There, yeah, now they're getting to the end of it. Here, I have a uh, increased more defense over here. I need a bigger challenge. Oh, yeah, a bunch of fine traps. <laughs> yeah, pestering at the side again. Okay, yeah, I'm just going to chase these few down. I suppose they're only taking down one archer. Only one. That was trivial. Heck of the troll. Never mind. It was going to Oh, it, it was going back to its passing. Oh, wait, you can't because you. <laughs> Mid air dance and. A... <laughs> okay, a, an almost T post orc for a bit. Okay, three skulls and nine extra. Okay, so that puts me up to 17 usable ones and we get the wall charger. Deals short range lightning damage. Okay. That could be useful. I need a better perch to put these freaking <laughs> pens. Okay, next mission would be the secret fortress. And, a, and it, a new ogre? Yeah, that, that looks and, concerning. Yeah. But that'll be for next time. Uh, okay, a bit of a complicated mini-map, but only two doors, luckily enough. And, okay. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, that, that went... Well, we went almost... Yeah, we went about a half hour longer, but... That was worth it, I'd say. We got through four missions. One, two, yeah. three, four. Yeah. Okay. And there's still a good bunch in this. <clears throat> uh, yeah. For now, though, we'll be continuing with this next week. Tomorrow, something Sunday again. I already have the, the games prepped. I need to test them to still to see if they work with OBS. Uh, yeah, but beyond that, uh, let's see. Thank you for watching. Uh, I, I, don't, I, I don't, I have no idea how to really say that, but so I'm going just going to go with Thai wisdom. Thank you for watching. Uh, also, thanks for watching Tilling Saturn. Uh, and anyone else who has been watching, uh, thank you as well. And as always, thank you especially, Dick here. Oh, you're most welcome, my friend. <laughs> and yeah next week more orcs must die three but tomorrow something sunday and then we'll be continuing with darksiders 2 uh, on that i am i have started a say a new save on the original darksiders 2 just in case the destinative edition starts showing problems that are yeah going to be a lot more troublesome than they might be worth so just as a backup, I'm playing through Darksiders 2, the original version as well. But beyond that, that's about it. So yeah, again, thanks for watching. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe, folks.